Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome to Let's Play Super Mario RPG Part 21. Today we're going to go to Booster Pass. And for Lucky, we're going to go to that tower in the background as well. So this area kind of looks like Moleville. It's uh, located right next to Moleville, so the area should be pretty familiar. And hmm, nothing's here. And that's an enemy. <laughs> the enemy is not too tough, though. It has some very solid defense, though. And they're disguised as plants, so be careful. Uh, hidden chest there, rock candy is in there. As you can see, we have some spinies here, or spikies. And a giant flower right there. To get rid of the spikies, just hug this crevice. And they'll turn into coins. And they won't bother you anymore. So anyways, I'm back at college now. I was uh, had a nice weekend. Uh, I gotta get back into working, though. As soon as I'm done with this week and next week, though, I'm pretty much going to be done, and besides finals. I can't wait. And uh, we're going to go to Booster Tower now, and Bowser is here as well. We've been seeing a lot of Bowser lately, but he seems to be troopless now. And uh, him seeing us watching him cry obviously can't be a high point for him. You, what are you doing here? Hmm. Wait a minute, what's going on? Toadstool's here! Oh my gosh! Wow, we found Toadstool! Wow, we found Bowser and Toadstool at the same exact time. Well, I guess we saw Bowser earlier, but... We actually encountered and met with them here. That voice, it's Toadstool. I thought she got away, but she's been stuck here. And Bowser's going to go back to his castle now, even though we've overheard that he can't get back into his castle. And the door is locked. Yep, it's definitely locked. Out of my way, you shorty. And Bowser's going to break the door for us. Wow. He's actually going to help us. Okay, we're going to be joining the Koopa Troop, apparently. <laughs> Mario and his friends have joined the Koopa Troop. Or so they're pretending. Okay, so uh, Bowser's on our team now, but since we can only use three allies to fight, they added a switch option. Bowser's at level 8, and he's a lot more powerful than some of these other characters, so we're going to replace Geno with uh, Bowser for right now. Hmm, let's talk to the Snift. Hello there. Booster's busy right now, so he can't play. Come back later, other time. Or you can force your way in. Okay, this guy isn't too hard. He has a very powerful magical attack, and, uh... Yep, he's using a blizzard. This can do quite a bit of damage to you. If it hits you, anyways. It did 20 damage to Mario. And Bowser, wow, look at that power. 50. Say what you want, 50 may be a low number, but, I mean, compared to what Mario and Mallow did... And Mario died, wow. He must have had some damage from, uh... Booster Hill that I forgot to heal. Oh well. And see, Bowser even takes magical attacks really well. So yeah, I thought I'd show you that fight, just because it's Bowser, and kind of introduce you to Bowser's strength. He has pretty good uh, attack and defense and a uh, magical defense or um, special defense but he has barely any special attack and his uh, special attacks are kind of useless as well. There's only one really good special attack and it costs a lot of hit FP and uh, yeah you don't get it for a long time anyways. Memorize these uh, this order of the boosters because it'll come in handy later and we got a hidden chest right here it's a frog coin and here's booster we're beating this lunatic for the very first time tower of amusement it's very amusing so far
Okay, let's follow him. He seems to be up to something. And he seems to be going this way. Or no, he's going to go that way. However, if we try to go that way, stiff, stiff number two will uh, prevent us from going anywhere. And now we have to fight Smith too, but uh, I'm not going to bother with that. In this corridor, we have a flower tab. Use it. So anyways, um, I got uh, Animal Crossing City Folk uh, yesterday. It's a pretty good game so far. If you like Animal Crossing, you'll like City Folk as well. But it's, it's kind of boring right now because it's the, I'm dealing with all the beginning stuff. And I'm, I'm not one of those players who... Crap, I missed. Okay, let's edit that out and get back here. <laughs> let's try this again. There we go. Yay! We got a masher. Okay, that had to hurt. I don't know who you are, that had to hurt. Okay, the masher is another item. It looks and performs just like the hammer, but it does a lot more damage, so definitely use it. And like, the masher is even stronger than like the next two available weapons for Mario. The masher is seriously that good. But we're going to go ahead and go on to the next part of the area. So yeah, City Folk's a pretty good game. Uh, I'll give you my full opinion on it later, since I'm still kind of just starting out. Not going to deal with that. Uh, something I want to mention, though. Those uh, Bob bombs are called Raw Bombs. And if uh, you're familiar with my YouTube channel, you should know that my first name is actually Rob, so it's kind of like a tribute to me. That switch did something to boost your pass, but we'll check that out later in the game, in the playthrough. What the? Hey, it's NES Mario! Yay! Yay, Mario! Okay, if you try to exit, uh, he grows small, and the timer uh, music plays. So yeah, it looks like we can't really go anywhere with uh, classic NES Mario. That's a cool little... Um, um, nostalgia moment though and it also appears in a lot of the Mario RPG games they always try to feature that somehow okay we have a save point so let's go ahead and um, I think I'm thinking there's like a hidden chest around here but I must have been mistaken so we're gonna save right here and we're gonna go on to the next part of booster tower okay remember these posters Take a look at Booster's family portraits and put them from the oldest to youngest. Okay, first one was uh, French Hat Booster, then Yellow Hat Booster, then Tongue Sticking Out, then Elvis, then Fez, and then Regular Booster, or uh, Current Booster. Okay, we have Elder Key. And here we have a Chain Chomp. Let's attack it. Or let's don't. They gaze into each other's eyes. Oh no. This magic moment. Okay, I don't know. Sing. You can turn around now. Uh, what, what'd you do to her? Oh, okay. Okay, Bowser has a new weapon called Chomp. The Chomp is actually one of the more stronger weapons. And it's actually stronger than a uh, weapon will be, uh, that, that'll be available to Bowser in the next town. So you're probably going to be keeping Chomp for a while. It's fine though, Chomp's a good weapon, I like Chomp. It's a Chomp. If I can find an enemy, we'll show you what it does. Especially since the timing's a little difficult. Okay, you have a mushroom, you can heal your wounds. And, um, I don't know what I'm doing. I thought I had a flower tub. Okay, going further up, we have more sniffs. Yeah, it's hard to tell, but uh, that's not uh, the way it looks. It's just going straight at it, so... There, yeah. Over here, we have a frog coin. And now we have an enemy fight, but we're going to show you how the chomp works. Also, look at how much damage the masher does. 
Okay, with a... Uh, oh, I gotta be Mallow first. Okay, with the Chomp, the, the timing is the third throw. Or the third... Whenever uh, Bowser uh, twirls the Chomp around his finger, when he does it for the third time, that's when you want to hit A. That's the correct timing of that move. And you'll know it works if the Chomp sticks on the enemy and bites him for a while. If it just hits the enemy and disappears, you did it wrong. Okay, uh, I think I'm going to end the video in this next room. Uh, join us uh, next time when we venture further into Booster's Tower. I'm Slim Kirby. See you next time with Let's Play Super Mario RPG.